Y'all now rocking with Ghetto Report. Ghetto Report. Ghetto Report. Ghetto Report. Ghetto Report Podcast. It's your boy FBG Butter, man. I'm gonna get a report podcast, man. You know what I'm saying? That's where this shit get done and we get shit done. Alright, what's up, Butter? How you doing, man? Man, I'm doing alright, man. You know what I'm saying? Blast feeling better than than usual. Okay. Yeah, cause um it's been a um couple months since we last um sat down with you. Some things had transpired since then. A lot of shit. Yeah, it's been a lot of shit there. A lot of shit. <laughs> a lot. In, you know, been in the blogs, been in the um YouTube world and Instagram and all that, but you said you're better than um you you been. What, I, what you I mean? Been, I mean, when I, what I mean by that is like you know what I'm saying. At first, yeah, it was cool. Like I I was still I was still sitting on house arrest, mm-hmm. but lately I've been off house arrest, so I've been getting the plus side to the free world. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Are you sure you off house arrest? Because uh, I, I I seen the video, man. <laughs> <laughs> you thought you was off house arrest, but they was on your. Yeah, you man. What, what the thing was, they said I had to wait on the sheriffs to come pick the house arrest band up and shit. I w- man, I woke up the next morning after uh, after that video and when it got that motherfucker took off because like my lawyer say I shouldn't have to sit in the crib or wait around. I beat my case. Yeah. So oh, you beat your case. You yeah. said you was gonna smack it. You got that shit beat. That's what you said. So I you smacked it. Hell yeah. Uh, hell okay. yeah. Congrats on beating your case. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. they they proper cause was they said they smelled marijuana. But you know, uh, 2021, that was like April 20th or April 21st, we became legal where you could smoke in your car and not be pulled out your car and your car be torn up and searched. Yeah. You know, so that, that was a, that was one plus. And the other plus was shit, the pipe was on the driver's side. I was on the passenger side. So it's not simply impossible for yeah. me to be mine. Yeah. So y'all good, man. Um, So um, why, why, they had, why didn't they, when you went to court, why didn't they take it off right then? Uh, shit, you know, they they want you to go wait downstairs. You oh, gotta yeah. go sit in that little office and wait on them to come do it, take it off. Yeah. I'm still butter. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I can't just be sitting in the county, just be sitting around dangling. Everybody wait, everybody. It was a lot of motherfuckers at court, too. Yeah. I don't even play like that. I catch fooling them on the reroute. That's what I did. I re rocked that re rock me. Yeah, so, so you left with it still on. And how many days later did this happen with the video? Uh, uh, shit, you know, I did this shit with DJ U the same day, the same night. I, the, after I left court, I was on the phone with bro. Yeah. Let him know, like, should I beat my shit? Let's get it going. Yeah. Okay. So, um, what 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 did they say to you? Like, what you doing? You supposed to be home? Yeah, they was trying to, they, uh, they talking about some, technically I was still on the program. Yeah. But I have, how I'm on program if I beat that bitch. Yeah. I don't even got no case with y'all. Okay, so yeah, um. We didn't really talk about you growing up. Like, so when you when you was growing up, did you did you play sports? Hell yeah, I, I was I was playing football. Uh, I was at the line. If I started off as running back, and then I uh, and they put me on the line. I ended up getting put on the line, and then uh, I hooped too. You know what I'm saying? I hooped for like probably like freshman year to like junior year. Then I fell back on that shit. You was on the team? Hell yeah, I wasn't starting though. But you got some minutes. I always got a little tick. What was you, what was you averaging, man? Who? Oh, you know what I'm saying? On an average game, probably like four points, five. Okay. Okay, because a lot of people try to guess it. Four points? Yeah, like four. Okay. Four points, ten rebounds, because I can yeah. jump, so I'll be getting up there. Yeah. You're going to get up there and get that ball. So what happened to your ball career? Why you stopped junior year? Shit, man. That shit wasn't just working. Wasn't working. Hold on, give me a second, Lord. I'm going to hit this off. Oh, man. Here you go. Let me get that. Right, y'all know me on camera, like, uh... What's up, sus? Do it. Oh, wait. Took a little bit more than I got, man. Took a little bit more than I got, man. Man. <laughs> Mind you, the man came back and came with you, man. Smoke break already. God damn, man. I'm upset. Uh, get that up. Uh, I I'm, I'm back. So what happened? Junior year, you stopped playing ball. I mean that shit just wasn't working for me for real, for real. Like I was only hooping at I only started hooping in high school cause my OG like, oh man, you gotta do something else. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then I I had all this money coming. If I graduate, OG's gonna give me some bread, give me a conscience, so I'm like, fuck it. Yeah. I started hooping. But then she was like, shit, you ain't really gotta hoop. 
Just graduate. Give me a high school diploma. What? Let's do it. Yeah. Got out that bitch so fast, you'd have thought I was possessed. So you graduated? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah? Hell yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. That's one thing I, I achieved, and I graduated in the real world. Yeah. So at home, who... Who who you live with growing up? Your mom, siblings, and your yeah, siblings. Yeah, my mom, my my two big brothers, my my little sisters. Yeah, two big brothers with um, they from your neighborhood too. Nah, and one of them from Motown, the other one, O five one. O five one. So you do yeah. got you got a brother from O five one. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's my big brother. Yeah, I named my son after him. He named his son after me. My boy. Yeah. How much older is he than you? Seven years. Oh, okay. Yeah, seven years, and then my other brother, four. They play sports too. Hell no. Oh, okay. <laughs> my oh. old, my older brother, my old, my older brother Birdman on um, bro. He got a hurricane wrist, so he definitely be he he got a job though. Yeah, he got a job. You said he definitely got a job. Okay. Wrist gang mean cause. Okay. 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 <laughs> All right. So um, let's talk about this. Yesterday, the trial for Old Block started. Shit, today too. No, I'm saying it started yesterday, but uh, I know it's today too. Shit, um, shit been going for like since since the first. Oh yeah, yeah. Let now last month on the tenth is when they started. Shit. Okay, what they was picking? Yeah, they jury, jury selection. Yeah. I think it's like what seven ass. Yeah. That's yeah. Lot, so shit. um, did are they expecting you to come down there? Did they subpoena you to come to the trial? Hell no, I ain't getting no subpoena, man. Okay. I'm straight. Yeah. Well, I've been cool. I've been outside with my homies. You know, we've been vibing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Video shoot yesterday, me and J-Main. For what song? Uh, It's actually called That Start That. Yeah. So y'all be looking out for that, man. That Start That drops on time this week. You know what I'm okay. saying? Okay, so, but so they had, allegedly, I don't know what's true or, or what's not, but allegedly they had your name in the paperwork saying as a, a government witness. Man, listen, man. On some real shit, brother. <laughs> I ain't got nothing to do with that shit, shorty. Right. Like, that's their little own little thing that they got going on. You know what I'm saying? Unfortunately, them telling on the next motherfucker didn't work in their favor, man. You know what I'm saying? Who they told on? Man, they always telling on somebody. Name, you yeah, who, no, who they like, tell on that like, didn't work in their favor? A lot right of people, now. like, they brought up a lot of names. You know what I'm saying? That's why a lot of murders and shit, we ain't implicated now. Yeah. They wanted that bitch for duck murder. You got Tuka murder, Model. You got all type of motherfuckers. They try to get... See, motherfuckers try to do what I did, and it ain't work for them. They yeah. try to tell them they did. I'm like, I give you this, hey. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nah, nah, dog. They all fucked up because y'all got wrapped up in some fuck shit. And mm -hmm. now, they, now they was trying to do what they always do. Oh, man, I got to figure a way out this bitch. Yeah, so so some of them on that case right now, they, they're telling, basically. For sure. Yeah. So They're telling on, on each other. On each other. <laughs> So it came out in the paperwork that they um, told on all these other murders that you just named. Yeah, man, shit get crazy, shit get trenchant. Yeah. So, but the feds are they? They didn't subpoena you at all to come down there. Hell no, okay. I ain't get no subpoena in the mail, man. They in the mail, shit. I think yeah. they gotta do that in person or something. Oh shit, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. So um, yeah. So um, what's your relationship with King Yellow? Who, yellow girl? Yeah. Yellow girl wants some attention. You see what I'm saying? Yellow girl, like 34. Uh, like 30, he at least 34. He, yellow girl, at least 34, right? You see what I'm saying? For like, so like, like 34 years old. You see what I'm saying? And like, he been doing this shit like 16 years. Mm -hmm. He might been rapping his whole life. Ain't no telling with people like him. And right now for yellow girl, he trying to figure out like, damn, why the fuck is this nigga butter passing me? You know what I'm saying? Unfortunately, you know, he just ain't got that uh, in him. I don't know why you want to see him. Ain't nobody yeah. here to see big guy. Like, you know what I'm saying? He cheesy as hell. He ain't really, like, I just thought I get some money on him, right? But see, like, Yellow Boy, one of them niggas, he been flexing so long about having money and the truth coming out. Like, you really fucked up living with, living off Ruger while he in Vegas. And you see Butter, like, I'm climbing the ladders, Lord. I'm in y'all, like, I'm big dog and shit. Now they on, he don't understand. He like, damn, this the shooter. The shooter got more money than me, Lord. It's your problem. That's your fault. Let me tell you why it's his fault. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? He jacked himself. He went out to Cardi B when he was in the position to win. And he used his position for a clout chasing move instead of using that bitch for what it was worth. Yeah. And that's your fuck up. Like, shorty, you can't, he can't, like, yellow girl, if you watching this, because I know you're going to watch it, you my fan, but 
he can't be mad at another motherfucker for outshining him and passing him because that's your fault. You fucked up on that blood. You was cloud chasing. Now I was sad and you know my I was at GD too on some GD shit. Like so, it's like how you fuck up with one of the guys. He 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 gonna make sure you don't get nowhere else. Not 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 close to him. Yeah. I don't even want this nigga in my sadness. Keep that goofy away from me. You see what I'm saying? When he could have really been one of them niggas where, oh damn, he locked in with my bitch. My, that's what my bitch call him. Her dog. That's her brother. Whatever she would have decided to call him. You know what I'm saying? He would have been locked in. Oh damn, that's yellow. Let him in. Get shorty around us. He GD too. He, you feel me? Yellow boy got his own ties with him, with Jay Prince and them. So it's like, you know, he could have been in a situation. He could have been in a good place, but unfortunately, he ain't man. And folks is really shitty as fuck. You feel he, he ain't from my block. And a lot of people start to pick up on it, like, oh, no, he not even really from over there. He just hang with dude. Now, don't nobody want to see the outside niggas, the outside of niggas, the outside people that's trying to be into a little dirt now or Keith now. They want to see the motherfuckers that's actually been into it with them niggas and still into it with them niggas. And I know recruits, and Yellow Boy's ass is a recruit. Yeah. Two, I mean, like, 2,500 on, some, on views on, uh, off YouTube from going from... 100k to 50 Now you are like 2,000 views It's crazy Yeah he, Like And you got a Gang Don't nobody fuck with Man's bro He got a <laughs> Yeah <laughs> Yeah yellow girl Got a rape cuss um, Bro don't nobody Fuck with Man's gang You feel me Like Cause I can't trust you Then I It make me go Look back on the video Where he Where he whooped the nigga Down in Vegas right Cause he say Dude was supposed to be Jacking off to the little bitch When she woke up what nigga, what the fuck is you? He'll creep, he'll creep y'all to both some creepy motherfuckers, but you gonna whoop him. Yeah. Motherfucker should have been whooping your ass, motherfucker. Found out you was fucking that little girl. What? So he got convicted of, of, this, of this rape? That's why he went to jail for him? Man, don't let me get the line. Yeah. But I definitely think that nigga been to jail, my nigga. Um, bro, don't let me get the line. I definitely think my, my boy, I think my boy got a, uh, I think he got a, I think he got that stay away from children case. You feel me? No, no, no school, no parks. <laughs> Folks got to register when he come through the community. You can't even live nowhere at peace. Motherfucker just look you up on the sex list. Here's Yella. And always stop playing. No, seriously, though. Folks, like, come on, gang. You got the on, on, like, you should be the last motherfucker talking, gang. Like, especially when it comes to another motherfucker because it's like, you got your own shit. To, you got your own shit you stepping in. You and Yellow Boy, nigga, he want hit, he like to be in shit knee deep. Yeah. Ain't got nothing to do with it. Um. So you used to be cool with King Yellow. Yeah, till we robbed that bitch for his chain. <laughs> and that's when things went south with you and Yellow. Like I ain't gonna lie, like it ain't even really no real smoke though. Like, cause technically he didn't pay for the chain, gang. Like my my homie paid for the chain. You feel me? It was really, like, if we being technical, like, it was really her chain, gang. She just let you, she was letting you wear shit. You feel me? So, it was like, if anybody should have been mad about the chain, it should have been Queen D. But Queen D broke my chain the night before at the yeah. club. So, she gave me that one. And he thought he was going to get that shit back. That shit over with, gang. That's my chain, gang. It's my chain. But it's all right, brody. I, I ain't, ain't no hard feelings, yellow girl. You know what I'm saying? I just understand Yellow Girl being his feelings, man. You know, I'm off house arrest. I've been shining. I've been on a lot of shit he been wanting to do. I've been on a lot of platforms he been wanting to be at. But ain't no real static with bro. You know what I'm saying? If I could rewind time, I probably would have gave him his fake ass chain back on um, bro just so he can stop crying like a little bitch right now today. So when when did when did this happen? Before you went to jail or after you came home? Now this shit this had this shit happened the day I went to jail. The day you went to jail. And did y'all speak about this afterwards? Yeah, we talked about it, man. But it was like, when we talked, it wasn't really. He's like, oh, man, fuck that chain. That shit was fake anyway. Woo, woo. Mm -hmm. But it was like, still, if fake or not, it's still, it was yours. Yeah. But we ain't going to get into that right now. But like, yeah, we rotated. He was like, oh, that's just little shit. I, don't, I just didn't fuck. With. He want me to pick a side between him and my rapping. Shorty. Unfortunately, I've been just to, I've been in a little bit more shit with her than I have with you, gang. You see what I'm saying? I'd rather fuck with her than you, gang. 
You can't be mad at that. Yeah. Yeah. So um, yeah. Plus she with the handler on Togo Group on first grade. So it's like, get your weird ass on, gang. Yeah. So you was around King Yellow when he was around Cardi B. That was folks them. Uh, technically, like Queen did the reason the motherfuckers was even getting 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 good like that. So it was like. Yeah, we was around though. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Cardi B birthday party that she had out here, in a uh, King of Diamonds. She actually had both clubs. She had King. <laughs> she uh, pardon me. She had. She actually had both clubs. She had King of Diamonds and Queen of Diamonds. You know, they was across the street from each other in uh, 2014. Uh, um, bro, it was me, Duddy, uh, PBG, Chemo, Shooter, Sean. From, it was I. Had, I had the whole PBG with me at the time. Um, bro. And you out there I, Every story Anybody from my side Tell for you don't Never hear no story About them fucking Tay Savage yeah. Shorty wants to hang with us um, Bro R.I.P. Pappy What you mean About Tay Savage He just won't hang with us Like You know what I'm saying You see I just named Like half of the whole crowd He ne- he always talk about Yeah cause when I was With my brother now He was not there He was lying He was a lie Yeah Nah let me stop playing Nah seriously All oh, the people you was with Is cool with Tay Savage that's his brother and his homie, you know. Yeah. Folks would ask us to be lying. He went out south with us. He went out there, man. He was one of them kids. He couldn't hang with us. Yeah. Um, baby. Um, Trenches News. You cool with him now? Or, or y'all? Man, so look, You still want to beat him up? Trenches. Hey, look. Swipe know what's going on, yeah. bro. Swipe know. Folks got to see me. But ain't no real mm-hmm. static. It's just like he know what he said. Some shit he was saying out of his mouth. Yeah. He, he know he overstepped his... He overstepped with the game. Yeah. So folks got to come see me like we grown as hell. I never try to harm him. I ain't going to kill nobody. Right. But like his, we got to see with the handshake. Like we got to catch the fade, bro. You know what yeah. I'm saying? I don't be like people playing with my peoples and shit, bro. You feel me? Yeah. Um, yeah, because um, he was basically saying some stuff before, you know, that, you know. Rubbing. Which, yeah. That shit was rubbing me so wrong. What, which one, which rubbed you wrong about the... His story of how Kyra died. Yeah. Just a lot of his stories, like a lot of shit he was telling wasn't facts, you feel yeah. me? It was some gas on it? Yeah, it was, a, was it a lot of extras ga- on it? What was it was it? a lot of gas on a lot of shit he used to be saying. But it's like them stories that he heard another motherfucker say, heard another motherfucker talk about, you know what I'm saying? And by him, so, by him being so far on the internet... He er- he he reiterated everything in his own turn. He painted certain shit, and here's the picture he wanted it to be painted in. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? He added what he thought. Oh yeah, let me add this on because you got to think a lot of people who watching this shit. They don't know. They don't. They want the. They just t- they just hearing what another motherfucker who's saying they was there saying, yeah. and they interested in the story alone. Right. So he grabbing their attention, and I just felt like shit. It was like slightly the wrong attention because he was giving out he was giving out for bad, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? He was giving out for fucking he was, he was lying. Fuck all that. I ain't even using no big ass word. Yeah. I'm not even that educated. Shut the fuck up, y'all. Yeah. I'm trolling. But now though, like seriously though, like I felt like he was stepping outside of his boundary lane, his boundary lane, because everybody got a lane, man. It's always lines and lanes and everything mm-hmm. ready for certain people. And I felt like when it came to certain shit he was saying when it come to our hood, I felt like he shouldn't have been saying, especially when it came to Kyra. But you know he was he was over in y'all hood for a while, so a lot of people consider him from over there. Man, Probably. he was in our hood, yeah. they hood, he's everywhere, right? Yeah, yeah. and he, he beat anybody. He was everywhere. It's just like. My mom and a lot of our people know from Newtown. You see what I'm saying? Or the Addie B. Wells. And Newtown them had a spot on our block. So we, we respected them. Because, yeah. like, shit, half of these niggas probably our mama's little brothers or our mom and them cousins. Yeah. So um, going through this trial situation, too. He going through the same situation. There's a lot of things on him. Fuck them niggas, G. Um, did this bring up like conversations with other people that you may be cool with, want to question your involvement and stuff like that? Yeah, like I ain't gonna lie, cause I be having the handle those with me. So like, folks, them definitely 
when that shit came out, they want to know because like like motherfucker, we talking Rico game. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? And my homie really they they want to like damn, are we in, are we in, in some type of shit? Like, do we gotta worry about you? Because yeah. the internet saying one thing, but it, it's different when. That's how you. That's how I decipher who was my friends and who wasn't my friends, because the people who fuck with me call me and and, and press me about it. Man, what the fuck going on, bitch? Mm-hmm. What you really got going on, shorty? And the niggas who's acting like they was fucking with me, they was behind my back. Yeah, this red ass nigga, you know? Yeah. It's not not, not coming to be like niggas. Oh, I'm a man for I'm anything. You can't be because if you feel the type of way about a motherfucker, I'm addressing the nigga. Hey man, what the fuck you got going on, shorty? Yeah. Like what's really going on, nigga? Uh, and our names involved, like Rico. Shit, that's that's crazy. I think about it, like Rico. That's Racketeer and gang affiliate, yeah. all type of shit. Like, and what's a gang? You can't have a you can't have a gang war without two 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 sets being in the tour with each other. Mm-hmm. And when they start doing the cleanup, they clean fucking both gangs. Oh, bro. So it's like that shit serious. Mm-hmm. Swipe. He 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 wants some clickbait shit because he already out the mix. He can't come around nobody anyway. He can't be around his own home in them anyway. So, so swipe can't be around his own own homies. Now you're saying he couldn't or be before this. Oh, before happened. even before it came about that his name was in paperwork or whatever the case might have been. Like swipe already couldn't be around motherfuckers. You feel me? Because he was on some. He surely playing both sides. You gotta think about it. And then this O Block shit, surely like he was selling them niggas guns, one or some shit like that. And if I was reading it right, I think he supposed to sold them. What, Two of the guns that was used in the duck case or something. That's oh. how his name got brought up in it. Now it's making sense. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, come on, come on, bro. But that's his fuck up too, though. Yeah. Because he come back Nash. <clears throat> he been saying shorty them was rats and they had they had, they had swapped their freedom for your freedom. But then you go around, you selling, you you got some whole other shit going on with these niggas. You selling these niggas guns. Yeah. And now they threw your stupid ass under the bus. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because I did ask him. I asked him that before um, when I interviewed him before, and um, I asked him like being around both sides. Did anybody take like question you? You you was there for a lot of allegedly. You was there for a lot of things that transpired. Did anybody question your involvement or something like that? Because you 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 was living in both areas and you hanging with both different sets. Like you know, so that shit screamed back that. though. Yeah. yeah so um. When, when 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 the feds came to see you, they came to see you when you was man. No feds, they look at the man. Listen, cuz you just try to slide that motherfucker in, then you cut. No, I'm asking because they <laughs> they saying they came to, they came to see you. I'm, I ain't I ain't hey, trying look, to slide nothing. Nah. I'm asking. When the feds <laughs> came to see you. They had to come see you to question. Man, you. look, they couldn't question me, man. I got I had to pay the attorney, Jonathan Goldman, man. Okay, you know so what I'm they saying. Came to see and, you. and before that, and before Jonathan Goldman, I had another paid attorney. You know what I'm saying, Haley Austin. Who? I, Haley, Haley Austin. Austin. Okay. She a, she actually a federal defense like she she fight fed cases that's what so, she do so they came to see her they they reached out to her reached out to her you know they, they can't reach they can't talk to me yeah see if it went for these interviews and shit like that on paperwork I'm slow as hell shorty all right no seriously like on paperwork like I I've been shot in the head so you know I have to learn how to, like on paperwork I'm mentally retarded so technically you nobody. Yeah, can't okay. nobody come talk to me technically yeah. without a parent guardian or or, the, or a power attorney or, well, or my attorney with me. So that's cap. Okay, but you did tell us on the last interview that Lil J had, Lil J had, had the people yeah. try to come. Yeah, okay. Tried to come. Okay, so that's why I'm mad. That was a big key yeah. word in there. Okay. You forgot to listen. So okay. I said he tried to have the feds to come talk to me about that shit. Yeah. I ain't doing that shit. I wasn't doing that shit, sure. I wasn't. I want to send Von to jail for some shit that I know he ain't do, even though he was claiming it. But yeah. well, who the, that's weird as hell. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, okay, so why do you think people threw your name in this situation? I mean, like. Forget the, uh, the, you know, the Vaughn situation, but I mean, why do you think like, they threw your name in this particular. Overall, you know what I'm saying? Body is a good, a good ass escape boat. You know what I'm right. saying? My fuck like to throw attention out for me. My fuck, that's already on him anyway. Mm-hmm. But shit, we gonna talk about how his homie them was trying to give up, give me up. Who? Fool them from the O. 
They was trying to give you up on what? They, they trying to get me up And I ain't do nothing shorty mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying My little sister did that shit shorty I just be in the streets With the gang members So You say your little sister did what? Whatever they said I was trying to do Yeah Cause they be snapping The O be snapping They be cutting up shorty yeah. When they get locked up Like in real life Like motherfucker had to really go look at that shit Like Like you got Louie you got eat all. You got motherfucking. Are you saying they these people didn't want your name and they? Yeah, they yeah. They's like like it's a, it's a lot of it be a lot of niggas who motherfuckers look up to who mm-hmm. these niggas really motherfuckers get caught up in shit. Motherfuckers, I mean, I got a murder for I got a murder for a murder. I got a murder for a gun. These niggas in uh they give you up. Yeah. So you said you said Louis e yeah, dog yeah. and who else? They they they. Them Do niggas for, for sure Louis Toss a nigga shit Right on the bus Um bro Now right now You got them You got the O-Block 6 The Sloppy 6 Oh Neil They so fucking sloppy Lord Like Shit nobody even knew They did that shit shorty It ain't even that much Show boasting on the murder In this world Without Without you wanting to go to jail for it Yeah You see what I'm saying And in, in real life like Shorty, who the f- I right, look. Listen, if you get wild, right? You th- you gonna you 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 sending the, the article, the news article around? Like, look what I just no. did. Who doing shit like that? Who even talking through a text message about going to kill somebody? I just killed. Woo woo woo. He got a news article. Who do shit like that? Somebody that won't go to jail. I mean, like. Who do you blame, Alien? Do you blame? You gotta blame the person. You gotta blame yourself for if you the one that did it. You know what I'm saying? Sending an article saying you did this X Y Z. You gotta blame yourself at the end of the day. And I ain't gonna lie, man. When it come to murders and shit, short like cash out receipts is not it, cool. Why the fuck is you cash out somebody some money if you allegedly accused motherfuckers allegedly accusing you of killing a motherfucker? You want a cash out receipt? Yeah. Sure. Give everything on the powder. I, like that's how I look at it. Like y'all gave, they gave the feds everything they wanted and everything they needed. Gang, when motherfuckers really sitting back and looking on, like, damn, was y'all really doing that? Yeah. And then they say one of the niggas in that uh, who supposed to drop the low was recording the whole shooting, recording Duck in the shooting. Mm-hmm. Why the fuck was y'all even have who have niggas like that around, gang? You dropped the low, you made sure he was still there. Get the fuck on. Mm-hmm. Why is you recording me? Right. I mean, like, if they go call anybody the police, man, they gonna they gonna feel like anybody did something wrong, man. They gotta they gotta fault they self, man. Mm-hmm. Y'all had a lot of mishaps in that shit. And y'all motherfuckers, everybody claim to be gangsters, real niggas and killers. Like, certain shit shouldn't have happened. Okay, going through this, right? You know, a lot of people go through stuff like that. Did this take a toll on you? Did this bother you? You know what I'm saying? It like, do. Yeah. Like, how does it affect you and your relationship with people? Did you you lo- you have had to lose some friends or people I you have, thought was friends? I have lost some close associates and motherfuckers who I fuck with due to the shit that's going on because they don't indulge in certain shit that's been that that I allowed to happen in my life. Like, folks, them don't. A lot of my homies don't, don't like their names and shit being said on interviews. Certain stories, folks, I'm like, you shouldn't have been telling. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah, throughout this, hell, y'all lost some friends. And throughout this case shit, that's what dude, no, fuck out with these fucking goofy ass niggas, man. They want to talk about who killed who and all the goofy yeah. shit to the feds. You know what I'm saying? It happened, but that, it, it, it definitely shifted my relationship with a lot of people. Mm. Is that why you be off the pink panties and nine nines? You feel me? I, I, you know, like seriously though. Yeah. I get how I cope. I cope with my demons. Like sometimes the, I, I be off X, or I do a, I do drink or pop blah, blah, blah. It be like, damn, do I feel like coping with my 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 anxiety, my stress level, sober, yeah. or do I rather or do I rather cope with it high? And sometimes I, I rather like deal with my problems high. Because it'll keep me from lashing out or, or overthinking the situation. I'd be level and cool with it. Like, okay, let me let me get a situation a, yeah. a, a second and think on it. So, but but being off these drugs, right? Your problems don't go away. They still be there. They still be there. Yeah, when I'm sober, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
Don't forget that money right now. I can go, go do it again. Go yeah. get high again. Just chill. So, do you ever think about leaving it alone? Leaving the drugs alone and stuff like that? See, I have. See, look. See, what I have done to substitute me. See, what I have done to substitute me from getting high all the time was I had stopped eating red meat. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm doing one, one, one healthy thing for my body. Yeah. You know, I don't eat red meat. It hit different one. I don't eat steak or Italian beef meat. Yeah. Or chicken. I so like you, eat is fish and, and vegetables. As, that's one of your favorite sandwiches, so you don't eat that no more. Man, I don't do no fuck around, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That shit was poison the body, man. Yeah. So, um, we see a lot of people o- overdose, you know, rappers and stuff like that. You do you ever think about that? Yeah, you know my baby mama OD'd off, what, off perks and shit, yeah. gang. So hell yeah, I definitely think about it. But when I get high, like I don't overdo my high. I don't keep chasing the high. I know I'm the type I just get high to just ride with the high. But do you ever think that other people thought the same thing? Nah, they do. But then you gotta think about it. A lot of that yes get to over chasing that bitch. Three, yeah. four, five zans. I ain't even off no whole zan. I'm off a piece of a zan. Yeah. So I'm just saying because you know you, you got a, you, your baby mama died. Or she overdosed. You got a daughter from her, right? As well, and you have what a son? Yeah, I got uh, three boys. Okay, you gotta be there for your kids, man. Um, and make sure you you know because you 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 talk you was talking about it last time how you was there for your kids and you know what I'm saying you're doing all this stuff. So I'm just saying you you know might want to chill on the um you know yeah hell yeah um so a couple months back. Um, we seen the video You going to jail And you was Crying on Crying the like a motherfucker I was crying like a motherfucker Shorty Cause it's like Alright so Like alright You gotta think I'm paying the bills In this crib All that to be here To live <coughs> To live here For my daughter to live here We live here We live here comfortably So for the police To come and tell me Like Oh you not supposed to be here But I know Should I just pay bills In this bitch And my mama Not gonna not Tell the sheriff like, oh, he can be there, cause she got her own crib. I got my own crib, right? We living too, but this bitch in her name. So, you tell me that the motherfucker who say who house this here said I can't be here, but y'all don't want to call her. Y'all just trying to take me in. Yeah, it's crazy, and I'm getting locked up in front of my daughter. I'm making all these promises to her, like, oh, baby, I, ain't, I promise you, I never go back to jail. And I'm gonna do right. Ooh, you know what I'm saying? This like real promises I'm making to my daughter, like. So for her, she looking at me, she like, Daddy, but you never said you you said you never going back to jail. You know what I'm saying? That shit, that shit tugging at my heart. I'm like, tell him, like, if motherfuckers was really listening to the video, I'm like, man, hold on, wait, just chill. My daughter and my mama all I got, just call my mama so she can tell y'all I'm supposed to be here. Just chill it's out. Her crib. Yeah. Yeah. You feel me? That's her crib. Just chill. They so, all, why, so why they saying you wasn't supposed to be there? Man, they tell me I was. A motherfucker called in and said they didn't want me to. But when they initially pulled up, they said that they was coming for a routine check. You know what I'm saying? So that's like every other month. The sheriffs will come out and do a routine check on the crib. They come inside. They come in okay. and search the crib. See search where they it? Yeah, they come and search the house. The, the routine, whole house. The whole crib. Yeah. Because I'm still fighting the case. They want to see if I'm sell any narcotics in here, mm-hmm. any, uh, any, uh, uh, any weapons mm-hmm. and shit like that. <sighs> And they got to check and see if the hot water work, the cold water work. Oh, because your daughter? No, just to be on house arrest at the house. They gotta, the house got to be fully f- fully functioning. Yeah. Okay. So so they never called. They take you to jail. How long was you in jail for? Like a week. A week? Two. No, nah, two weeks. You had to get bail or did they just released you? Uh, back on house arrest. They, rele- they had released me back on house arrest. I had to go in front of my judge. And then once I went in front of the judge and the judge had went over the paperwork, she was like, yeah, y'all did everything. Backwards as hell. This man, this man not even supposed to be in her. Yeah. So she kicked me back out on house arrest to the same house. Yeah. What, what, what's the 26 for? I, I see that on your, you know, your chain. Yeah. The, the cup. I mean, it's like, it's a, it, it's like, it's, it's, it's a number thing in life for me. 26, the, that, the number 26 pop up a lot for me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I'm just number twenty six. It's like it's my name. It's yeah. me. Okay. It's another. It's another. So they call you two six. Yeah. Or they be like number twenty six. Yeah. Okay. So um, rap, when did you start rapping? 
I, I started in rapping. Jail? Nah. Like slightly in jail is when I in jail is when I was like, yeah, I think I could do that shit. But when I came home at 19 and did a song with uh Flame. Who? Uh Flame. Mm-hmm. Um bro. J T Flame. Um, Where's bro. he from? He from our shit. He from but he was signed to Ruga in, he was signed to Mama Duck at one point. So they'd be okay. like J G B C I Flame. Yeah. That's my little cousin. But That's him cousin? Yeah, him and Trigger the reason I really like him Trigger and, and Flame, Trigger and Duck was the reason I started rapping. Mm-hmm. I did the feature with Flame. Duck paid for our studio time. And then when Trigger came home from jail, Trigger Lady paid for his trick his studio time one night and I paid for his studio time the next night. He was like, bitch, just get in the studio with me. Get in the studio with me. Yeah. So you started rapping since then. Okay. Hell yeah. Um, you was in. So you, I seen a video saying you was in jail. And you had you y'all was making somebody rap. Who was y'all making rap? Oh, uh, we was making Loso, nigga from Over East. We was making this nigga named Loso. And bro, Shorty had that shit. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. Buffer told me he'd be rapping this shit out here now. But I, you know, I don't be listening to everybody music and shit Because, you know, nowadays You know, motherfuckers just be dissing people They don't know Just the dissing motherfuckers mm-hmm. So I feel back on listening to Everybody else's music Yeah In Chicago Why, he be dissing? Uh, I don't know, shit I don't even want to do no homework on that shit Yeah, yeah Okay, so you was on DJU Last time And you said you don't do no average shit But you called the girl that you was with average the girl that was there, you said yeah, she's average. That was a, that was an average chick. <laughs> she was very on the average side. Yeah. Why? Why you call out like that? She was with y'all. I mean, like yeah. honestly though, it, I was. It was a it was a little joke yeah. for sure. It yeah. was a little joke. It was a friendly joke. Plus that's gang. But like in real life, I do be having some little shit around me. I be having some nice little hoes around me, on bro. And she was just like, she was cool for that for the, for that flock, and she was with my little brother now. Mm-hmm. You know, so okay, she didn't take offense. She wasn't mad about it. I don't think she caught it. Did a she little bit. It? She caught it. Oh, she, she caught it. She caught it. Cause she didn't act like it in the moment. Nah, you know yeah. What I'm in the moment, she ain't act like cause she knew the cameras and shit was still rolling. Yeah. And she's like, she was telling me she didn't want to come off as a cloud chaser or whatever. But she definitely felt some type of way about it. She like, damn, how the fuck you gonna call me basic boy? Who you use just in my DM trying to get me to come suck your dick? <laughs> Indeed. Oh, what you say? Indeed. Oh, she did. Indeed. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> but I was bogus though for on some real shit though, cause I ain't, I ain't supposed oh. to came out came out of like that. Okay, so so the head must have been average then. That bitch was never average. Yeah. It was it was decent. Yeah. I gave her a seven out of ten. Yeah. So, so okay, that that might be a little better. Well, maybe that's, that's average. average. That's yeah. average, bro. Yeah, that's average. Average. Mm-hmm. That's <laughs> it wasn't an eight on. It was eight on the grade, no, no, man. Ten. Yeah. Cause I had some shit the other night on took I had my legs shaking on yeah. Sean Deal. I mean that bitch knees weak, legs shaking. Yeah. Oh, damn, little out west little bitch. Yeah, them little out west hoes get crazy. Like this, my third time hitting a bitch from out west. I must admit, the out west hoes can suck some dick. Yeah, took they can suck some dick, short. Shout out to the west side of Chicago, man. So you doubling back on her? I, I spun back on that already. Yeah. I got her waiting at my house, sleeping in my bed. I'm going to go home get some more of that neck. Yeah. <laughs> you crazy. So um, being out here doing, you know, in the streets or whatever, and there's a lot of people from Chicago and something, do you ever run into them? Like, did you ever run into, like, Lil Dirk or something? I mean, yeah, like, we we definitely hit our, our moments where we bumped into Dirk or... We done bumped into Lil Reese or bumped into somebody like, you know, this Halloween weekend, I had ended up bumping into uh, Lil Reese. Uh, not, not OTF, uh, Fola Reese from uh, out west. What they call him? Uh, Lil C. Mm-hmm. Um, bro, from sick, he used to be sick on my, but now he ain't, he ain't sick on my no more. You had issues with him? Nah, hell no. Nah, oh. We ain't had no issues, man. It was, it was, it was all love, man. Good vibes on um, bro. It was like, Cause the last time I saw him was I think it was like 2012, 2013 was the yeah. last time I ran into him in the county. Yeah, you feel me? Uh, him, one of the G, one of the GDs from uh, out west named Boosie and his cousin. Um, bro, they they stopped the motherfucker from jumping on me because uh, J Money, J Money and uh, J Money, C Day, Jahari from T Y B, 
was a couple of them up there. They used for the jump me. Mm-hmm. And fooling over my west like man, that shit dead, shorty. Y'all, y'all can catch y'all fade, motherfucker. Bump one on one, but if y'all ain't gonna jump shorty because shorty ain't no hoe. He like that. Uh, basically, like the whole west side basically was like, shit. Shorty stood up for himself, so y'all ain't gonna jump a motherfucker for standing up for themselves. Catch the catch catch the fade. Uh, so they wasn't letting it happen. Hell no. Nah. Yeah. They was trying. To, they definitely was trying to jump a nigga, but uh. It, Cause it kicked off Like we was already I was already up there With the ops You feel me mm-hmm. And when nobody Really on shit They know who I am I know who they is You feel me But then Somebody grabbed The motherfucking uh, The soap And wrote Fuck Jojo On the wall With the soap You feel me I ain't I ain't, I ain't tweak right away I just grabbed a towel Wipe the shit off Once I wipe the shit off I Boom I step out I go outside To the day room Step in the middle Of the day room Cut the TV off um, hey, look, this ain't what we doing. I'm on Tuka. We ain't saying fuck JoJo, none of that shit. Um, bro, I'm, I just clicked that shit off the wall. And I'm man, anybody in here want to bump? I'm on Tuka. We can bump. We can go in the bathroom right now. I'm a fucking going to the washroom and bump. Um, but ain't no saying fuck folks, no. That shit over with, boy. So whoever wrote that shit on the wall, you a bitch and fuck your homie. Yeah. You feel me? J Money, like, boy, watch your mouth. I'm, boy, I ain't watching shit on Tuka. Whoever wrote fuck, sh- uh, who, he like, uh, J Money like shit, shorty not even from your block. I'm, oh, you doing too much. I'm on Tuka, he from our block. Fuck you, talking about my homies. We clicked up with them, them guys. Yeah. Ain't no saying fuck shorty in here. So, so that's how that situation almost happened. You know? mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, they should beat my ass in that bitch, shorty. I ain't gonna lie. So you said you ran into Dirk too. Where you run into him? I ran into Dirk on 61st of King Drive. It was Dirk and Lil Reese. We walked in the stove, pressed them. You walked in. They was in the store, and this is like bef- when shit was going on. Yeah, that's twenty eleven. Okay. Oh, before like really kicked off. Yeah, that's like shit. Now shit was kicking. This shit was up. Yeah, it was definitely up. It just went up with Lime Round for real. Like, cause we ain't had no real static with dude. Them they ass off the other side of King Drive. They ass off State. Yeah. They passed State, gang. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And when I think about it, back then, we be shorties. Like we want to ride no bikes to go slide on. The lamb, that shit too far. Yeah. Now T Y M B, O Block, that's different. Six hundred, that's different. We on feet going to slide on them, shorty. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Um, I see you got that song with F Y B J Man. You've been playing. Yeah, um, I've been banging that bitch all day, shorty. What's your relationship with um F Y B J Man? I mean, like, at the end of the day, it's like it's entertainment for me and my homie, them bro. You feel me, like. Especially with me and J Man, cause me and J Man, like me and Shorty, we been through some real shit. Like yeah. folks that lived at my crib, all type of shit. Yeah. He was there the day I, the day Kyra died, I got shot. J Man was at my crib with me and Anthony, cause I went home. Mm-hmm. Feel me, J Man smacked the shit out of me. Get that boy, wake up. Yeah. I back out and tweaking so, shit. So you, would you consider he saved your life, basically? Yeah, I'm, yeah. I give him that. One. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, cause he did some real shit. That was some real shit. Cause yeah. I I black out on the couch. He fire, yeah. fire. Hey, bitch, get up, boy. He boy, your ass tweaking on Jaja. Wake yeah. up, boy. Open your eyes. Yeah, I'm in mean, that bitch bleeding out, shorty. Yeah. Um. So, so, you, basically, it was a skit. Cause he said you he, you pulled a gun on him when he brought you to um the cheese. cheese. Yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah not look, not. One one. See, I, see, motherfucker, gotta watch the interview. Yeah. Because. The skit came after the interview. The okay. skit was like, okay, yeah. I really did up on folks in that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Folks was coming that bitch, big ass block of cheese throughout the interview. I had to let them know, like, damn, gang, I already let you work a Pepsi up in this bitch. Folks bring a motherfucking big ass steak, steak block of cheese. Fuck who? <laughs> who baby on welfare? I don't folks raise. <laughs> that's what he said. That's that welfare cheese. Nah, I'm, that's what I'm saying. That's that big ass block of cheese. Don't fuck who used to eat snaps to get. <laughs> They look uh, welfare cards back in the days to get. Yeah. Feel me? Yeah, but I, I upped on folks in, the, in that bitch. But it's all, it was all love. Uh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I, you know, that joke was just a little too far for me. Yeah. I yeah, mean, yeah. I'm pro joke. I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm pro jokes now because I, I got a lot of shit coming right. out with the comedians. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Get up with Skimbone and a few other comedians. You know what I'm saying? We're going to make it even happen. Uncle Hank. Yeah. You know? Yeah, because, yo, you're naturally funny. You know what I'm saying? So. Some maybe you need to embrace the jokes, you know what yeah. I'm saying? More, but not too far. Not you know too what I'm saying? Far, not yeah. too far. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn bitch. I'm like, damn bitch, you went too far. He like, ah bitch, I ain't know. He like, that's why I say bitch. Don't do too much. But he pulled out big what the fuck is that? Yeah. 
So um, so when FYBJ Main said he's bigger than Duck, yeah, that shit it, hurt my feelings. It hurt your feelings. But did you know? Did you get what he was saying, or did he break it down to you? Or I mean, hey, for stuff for like the past couple of days, bro, how, like he explained it to me. He gave me a better outlook on why did he say it, mm-hmm. and it was more so on some. He was telling. He said he ain't saying that he bigger than Duck, but he feel like he is not. He feel like he he able to say that because he created himself to be in that lane to be able to be like, mm-hmm. oh damn, I'm be, I'm being mentioned with the greats. Mm-hmm. And I I understand that. Okay, now yeah, my name get mentioned with the greats. I can say I'm I'm just as big as Duck. I'm bigger right. than Duck. Yeah, but I still like. It still, it still be like Shit Folks paid it the way for me So that's something That I, I wouldn't Personally say I wouldn't personally say That I'm bigger than nobody Yeah I ain't like For real for real, for real. Like Even in the interview j Man, like Do you think I'm bigger than you I hesitated this, You know what I'm saying Cause I was fed for that I was just tell folks Like yeah I do think I'm bigger than you gang Yeah I know I'm bigger than you But I ain't bigger than my homies gang Ain't nobody bigger than nobody With, a, with this shit that's still my brother. Mm-hmm. He's still my homies. I'm just got a little more emotion. I don't make me bigger than you. It's just my emotion bigger. Yeah. So even even with Duck, Duck got you to rapping, right? Uh, so he he gave you the was you FYB first, and he t- changed it to nah. um, FBG. See what it was but, was I on Twitter? I was FYB Butter, Be, you know, Instagram and everywhere else. I always been FBG Butter, but. Like you go to all the old tweets, that bitch definitely gonna come up FY FYB butter because I really miss the fuck your bitch on yeah. Tuga, not your bitch in particular. Yeah. But yeah. I always got a nigga bitch with me, gang. Like no funny shit. So I don't even be tripping when the nigga crack my hoe. Yeah. So you was you wasn't you it was always FBG. Always. I always been FBG. I and that, uh, you know at some point I had fell back on folks and them though too though. You know what I'm saying? And oh, I was F- doing that FBG. W. Yeah, I was doing WTO with folks now. With who? With Lil Gay. Okay. Why, why, you, why you fall back? Because it was like, folks them had their own little thing going on. They was on some STL shit. And me, I was just trying to get in while I fit in, gang. I was just trying to be with the guys, folks. Yeah. It's my brothers. They had motion. But folks them didn't want me a part of their motion. Feel me? I always feel like folks them was shading me on the motion, you know? Who? Duck? Not nah, duck. not duck. Not duck. Like young. Cho used to shout me out on like every other song. Yeah. Dutchy would shout me out. He bought it this number twenty six that. Yeah. Psh, motherfuckers come home get into it with they mans and the motherfuckers don't even fuck with me no more, man. Well, uh, that shit be crazy, shit. Yeah. I'm better. When's the last time you seen them? Man, I just seen I seen Dutchy. Goddamn it, Lowski funeral, and then uh. I was just uh I just seen Young not too long ago. To, uh, I saw Young not too long ago. I had uh pushed up to his people in them crib. I stayed put, pulling up on his pops, and uh, you know that's how I ran into I ran into Young up in uh pops crib and shit. We was in that bitch just smoking, getting high, t- kicking and talking. Yeah, you spoke to him. Yeah, man, that was a minute ago though. Yeah. Um, Fyb J Man also insinuated you a crack baby. I know he got <laughs> joke. What? For that ain't even funny on Tuga no, for no, no. my mom. No, my mama don't even on Kyrie Shut it. My mama the top mama of all hold mamas on Shandia. Hold on, let me say this right. I met your I met your mom. Tuga I, I met your mom and it don't seem like that to me. My mama. I know he got jokes, so I'm like, why would he say that? Um, he bro, insinuated that on um. I only I ain't even gonna play with his mama. You know yeah. I fuck with her on Tuga. I fuck with his mama, but yeah. so I ain't gonna play play with that preppy lady. Right. That's why I'm like I seen your mom. Um, bro, I don't know why. Just you know, know what I'm my mama bigger when it come to that shit. On Tuga, thirty plus years in the hospital, but my OG ain't worried right. about nothing. She can retire at any day. On Shandy and my OG, love she good, gang. Yeah, my OG know she just she just started smoking weed two two years ago. Yeah, see, like I said, I met your mom when we, last time we did the interview, and I didn't get that vibe from her. You know what I'm saying? So I didn't understand why. He said that, but I know he got jokes. You know what I'm saying? He's a funny guy. I know everything ain't really, you know, what he said. So um, he also also bigged you up, too. He said he called you a real Tuka villain. 
But he said you, you was always on the block getting shot. You was just always out there. So he didn't want to, like, hang out there or something like that or just be always out there? Man, all right, look, man, I only got shot. I only been shot, like, four times on the uh, three times on the block, shorty. But <laughs> You said only? Yeah, shorty. That's little shit, shorty. Yeah. Like, I don't, bro. You can't, you can't ditch something out and then can't take it in return. I don't took right. I got fucked up. I fucked niggas up, too. Yeah. Oh, folks, great. I don't took it. Ain't no nigga. Oh, I was just going to say this, man. Ain't nobody never done nothing else than we ain't done back then. Yeah. Especially me, bitch. I'm big slimy T, and I'm steady telling y'all free slimy Lee on B. Like, no, seriously though, like all jokes to the side. Yeah, I've been shot a couple times on the block, but J Man ain't even really from the block that you can be get shot like that. Yeah, now nah, let me stop playing. I was seriously though, oh, like let's start there. We can start that <laughs> yeah. though, but I ain't gonna start that because like, you know what I'm saying? I've been in, I've been over that since '93 game. '93. I wasn't even born in 93. You catch okay, that riddle? Okay. Well, what year you, you see what I'm born, saying? Man, I don't know what year you was nah, born. No, I was born in 94. Okay. But I'm saying, like, that, that's how that's how I locked in with my motherfucking blocker. I feel like, nigga, I was already out there. Nah, but, like, I started walking to school in motherfucking 19, motherfucking uh, 97. I started walking to school by myself. At three years old? Yeah, yeah, nigga, it was me and my big brothers. What school you going to? Day kid? Nigga, I was going to AO Sex, and then that bitch punching on shit. <laughs> 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 So Punching. You, you was walking to school by yourself, you said? Yeah, I was walking with my big brothers. But okay. Technically, that's by myself because my big brother and them assholes. So if I'm walking with them and I ain't walking to their pace, they going to fucking keep walking on. Okay, so you, you, you get one of your big brothers is from 051. Was there ever an issue like with some people like in your neighborhood maybe with 051? And, you know what I'm saying? Because I, I, I know Billionaire Black is from your hood. Yeah, like so with, with that... Like, Billy didn't come to my crib like that, you feel me? Because Billy knew my big brother was from the one. Mm -hmm. So folks didn't come to my crib like that. But if folks was to come to my crib, folks would have been good back then. I don't know about nine, though. Why you, you feel say that? Because Billy the Rat on TV. He's a rat. Billy the Rat. That's his name, Billy the Rat, cuz. What, what Billy told on? His brother. He told on his own brother. That's why I said in the spose, I, I never, I never tell on my brother. Not, not my blood, brother. Oh, folks, gray. Not, not my blood. I ain't so, not my mud brother either. So, so what? What? What case he telling on his brother? With? Man, he know. They know. I know. We know. On two. Yeah, we need good. to know. We we ask. Man, this look. Report podcast. This get a report podcast. So what I'm gonna need y'all to do is I'm gonna need my fuck go do their homework on B. That telling on his little brother Muscle and his little brother. Yeah, 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 yeah. Muscle. Yeah. Give me a second, y'all. I gotta take a pit break. Yeah. Totally. So you called him Billy the Rat? Oh Neil, and, why not? Fuck it. And, and when did when did he tell on his? Um, brother? Well, that was like 2017, 2016. Yeah. And when did you find this out? Then? Shit, no, nah, oh. I found that shit out right then and now, Lord. Yeah. Um, bro, like it was a talk. It was, it was a talk amongst us, amongst our in the crowd. You know what I'm saying, motherfuckers? Like all y'all hear what's going on, motherfucker. I'm in jail though at the time. So you know, I'm man, what's going on out there, Lord? Photo, oh yeah, you know that shit with well, Billy just, just walk. That's why if y'all pay attention, like Billy have a lot of people around him, but his blood brother muscle. Where's his brother at? Was he at? with the six? Oh yeah. Oh, he's still around. Yeah, he just hang with four six. Yeah. Um, bro, he four six on YC. Um, oh, yeah. bro, he got a game like so. It's like I want to surround my. I want to be around. I, he he can't do nothing to him. Do they still speak? I, that I don't know. Yeah. But what I do know is he got out on his brother, and keep it and keep all the fake brothers around him. You got to make it make sense. Why? Why his real brother ain't with him? Yeah. He got all these fake cousins and and brothers and shit with him. Where's the real brother at? Yeah. We know Richie Jerks did, but what muscle? Yeah. Muscle don't want to be around that rat bitch. Cause he can't do nothing to him. Sure, he can't do nothing to him. This is my blood brother. This is my mama's son. What can I do to my big brother, fuck? I'm going to kill my big brother, hurt my mama, I'm break my mama heart. Mm -hmm. So I fuck with him, though. He's staying away from me. What case was this? Hey, right, man, that ain't got nothing to do with me, Lord. Was it? Was it? That ain't got nothing to do with me, Lord. Just, just know motherfuckers weren't facing over six years. So, so it was something like, and he told on his brother. It's crazy. Yeah. It's crazy. So you haven't seen... Or heard from him since 
Nobody seen or heard from Muscle since. No, I'm talking about Billy. Oh, Billy? Yeah. Man, yeah, I, mean, I be I, Man, you know what? I wouldn't even be on Billy the Red Ass right now, man, if he could control his company. What you mean? You see what I'm saying? Because everybody got company, brother. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And at some point, right, motherfucker got to control a company. Just because... I, I'm not gonna look. I, I'm not gonna be. I ain't even gonna use folks for example. I'm gonna use myself, gang. Yeah. If I got my cousin with me and my cousin sliding to it with my ops, I mean with my homie, them, yeah. I wouldn't even. First and foremost, I wouldn't even have my cousin around at all. Yeah. You into the niggas I fuck with. You into my homie. Yeah. Anything can happen. Right. Boom. Oh, some real shit. Nah. Anything can happen. But then he, Billy went as far as letting his cousin say fuck scrap, even though his cousin them is into it with MOB. But then it's like, what the fuck you got going on anyway, for? Why the fuck you even got your little cousin around rooking them anyway? Yeah. What if your little cousin say fuck you, fuck the guys that kill my homie? Yeah. You feel me? Now you, now you the guy my homie ooped because you being friendly as fuck with your cousins. Yeah. And then on top of that, you got your cousin them saying fuck folks now. He, oh, they said fuck perks first. Well, that ain't the conversation I got from the guys. Motherfuckers say, y'all with shorty them. Shorty said, fuck folks. Scrapped the same nigga on took him with 051. Them was fit to kill your bitch ass. On took him with 051. Them was fit to do so much shit to you. Scrapped the same nigga that stopped 051 and geo driving them from getting down on you every time you outside with us. Yeah. You got to think about this. Scrap look, scrap duck look cousin, right? Yeah. Billionaire that was like this with duck. When you saw duck, you saw Billy. You feel me? And Doc, you know that shit did, boy, that's my homie, boy. But you can sit around and watch a motherfucker say fuck scrap, scrap the same nigga that saved my life. Yeah. He saved me and Billy life today, I'm talking about. Yeah. Cause they say 051 of them was for the spank both of us. What was your lot? We was on MOB shit. You was on MOB shit and they, and they was over there chilling too. They was over there chilling too, cause the, we all fuck with the same people. Yeah. We all fuck we all fuck with MOB, you know? So and, and scrap saved your life. Scrap saved us. Yeah. Oh, um, bro, that's why I love Lil Brian game. Like, motherfucker can't tell me I can't merch on scrap. Folks that saved my life, we didn't get busy to get out there. Sure, that's my shorty game. Yeah. Feel me? So the hit being that even sit back and let a motherfucker say fuck scrap was crazy as hell to me. And he, he was right there in the video. Yeah, it was crazy. You let a motherfucker say, you let a motherfucker say fuck scrap. He the all they say fuck my brother. The person that said that was from where? His cousin, you said? It's his cousin, man. Yeah. I just found that shit weak as fuck, bro. Yeah. Feel me? Because at some point, we got to stand up for something, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm a stand-up guy for when it comes to my, my friends, my family, my people. Like, I stand up for my people, and yeah. I stand up for what's right. Yeah. I, like, a motherfucker say whatever they want to say about me, but, like, when it comes to certain shit, like, I'm open to, I'm, I'm open-minded to a lot of shit. And... I'm loving to a lot of people, but when they come to the motherfuckers who I know got my back, who who the head in my back and shit like that, I stand up for them. Yeah. If you wrong or right. Yeah. But if you wrong, before I stand up for you, I'm letting you know. Now, I ain't letting the world know. Or the motherfuckers that we we, we, we for to get it on know. I'm going to let you know, like, bro, you bogus. Mm -hmm. But you my dog. Mm -hmm. But you bogus. I don't know if Billy had that conversation with his cousin, but I, my people want to slip up and say, fuck my homie. Yeah, we connect short. Let that be known. Ain't no you get to. Because if I let you say fuck folks now, nah, every time you get high or you get too high, you're going to say fuck folks. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to be like, oh, I was high, fuck. Yeah. Nah, hell no, nah, bro. I just felt, I felt that cowardly. Yeah. Oh, bro. Because Scrap could have let his ass die. And this happened recently? Yeah, this happened recently. Yeah. So that's why you feel some type of way about Billy. Not because of the... Nah. Yeah. They ain't got nothing to do with me. That's his brother. Yeah. All right, so um, you tell a story about you no know, King Vaughn. Y'all jumped King Vaughn. I nah, ain't no jump on. Okay, so y'all didn't jump. You jumped on him. I put the you put hands the and feet on him. Okay, but this was before the actual war, right? So why? Like, nah, this was like during the war. Like, I thought. This nah, was I, nah, this was during the war. Okay, okay. Like, but it's like not all the time that you gonna catch a motherfucker and be able to kill him. Yeah. Uh, of course, but I thought, uh, okay, I didn't understand. Yeah, I thought see, it was like before the war nah, started, see, and you 
Some whatever. Nah, hell no. Nah. Like it was already going on with the O. Okay. It was already we was getting it on with them. They was Wick City. We STL Gyro. We mm-hmm. was getting it on. Mm-hmm. It just at that time he was playing both sides. He was on some I'm Killer War and I ain't O Block. I ain't from I ain't from the Wick. I ain't from Parkway. Yeah. <laughs> but in real life, he really from over there though. You know. Yeah. Say tell for them boys ass be doing them every day, boy. He and that bitch with shorty on. Yeah. You used to see him. Oh, yeah, bro. Over there. Cause you used to go through there. Right? I used to be in that bitch. Yeah. You feel me? All my all my people them from there. So you yeah. know I was in that bitch. But I was telling him for like man, shorty ass with that shit. You know. Yeah. You still got people from over there? Nah, my people don't mean in that bitch no more. Yeah. Hey, I mean, my cousin, she claimed her. She, she OB. Yeah, like, I got Buka, and I'm like, do you know? Yeah. Taste, taste, taste 600. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, um, you do music and you do uh, YouTube. You make more money off YouTube or music? YouTube. Okay. Like, the, like you, I, I, I ain't gonna lie. See, like, that's like getting this Apple to check and shit. That shit decent. You get an Apple check. Yeah, that shit decent. Off, of music. off the music. That's oh, yeah. decent, but it ain't I ain't I ain't got that million I ain't I ain't got that million view song yet. So like I'll be hundred K, five hundred K, fifty, sixty, eighty K, like them little checks be on the screen side, that should be decent, you feel okay. me? We're off of Apple. All yeah. off of Apple. No, nah, that's like all that's cause I went to Distro Kid. So, I got actually I got two I did Distro Kid and United Master. Okay. See what I'm saying? Yeah. So like Oh, they, I mean, that shit be decent though. Yeah, be decent, but YouTube better. YouTube's better. Yeah, hell yeah. You still got two channels? Oh. Got four now. Oh, you got four. Yeah. Okay. Well, and what, what's the channels like? Is uh, it, you right doing now the same thing on all the channels. No, nah, no, nah, different thing. Now, nah, uh, okay, right now one of like one of one channel at six k, another one at like three. I got one at two, and I got the forty five. Technically, I ain't really did nothing on them. I just been building them up. Mm-hmm. You feel me? So, um, do you plan on just doing both, or like far as the music and the YouTube? Yeah, or, yeah. Or focusing more on one? Or, no. I mean, like technically, they, they like going together. They coincide. Yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Because like, I, sometimes I'll be like, I damn, I got a studio session, and my studio session end up turning to like a YouTube yeah. session. I mean, YouTube is some shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it'd be like it. Like a tomato tomato thing with me. Yeah, yeah. Because people like to laugh. So, yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? If you're doing that too. Um, are you pushing peas? Currently, I am pushing peas. You're pushing what? Peas. Peas. Yeah. Not peace. <laughs> J-Man ain't pushing peace. I'm pushing peace, man. You know, I, I, I'm pushing peace. Some of us go get some money, bro. Yeah. I mean, like, I've been getting some little money. I was fucked up, Lord. Now, let me stop saying that on camera. I ain't never been fucked up, man. You got a mama that love me, y'all. So let me stop saying I'm fucked up. Or well, I was fucked up. Or you, you wasn't where you wanted to be. I wasn't where I wanted to be. Yeah. And I've been getting a, and Right now, the younger generation watching us just, and all they didn't watch us go to war. All they didn't watch us, everybody win, lose, win, lose, lose, win, right? Mm hmm. Out of all that, we ain't show these little dumb bastards nothing about no money. Um, first grade, we ain't show them how to get no dust, no pookie ducks, and that's what that's what I fuck up. Cause my big homie them was showing us how to get get to the bag. Mm-hmm. He's like, oh, y'all gotta y'all gotta get this, y'all gotta do that, y'all. But y'all, y'all want bullets? Y'all, y'all wasn't listening. Yeah, we was listening. Y'all was listening. Yeah, we was listening, but it's like, okay, gang, drug money only get you so far, gang. The streets only get you so far. The like street hustling only get a motherfucker so far in real life. What does gang banging get you then? Gang banging don't really get you nowhere. Period. Yeah. I mean, like uh, unless you go on every lick that come across your phone. Yeah. Um, bro, uh, real only real capers. In the room. Yeah, I ain't fucking going out for no cup of that one. Yeah. Real capers. Yeah. If you gonna be on the streets, but shit, even with them real caper legs, motherfuckers, them bitches go wrong, man. Mm-hmm. Um, bro, like everybody not a staying gang, everybody not going, everybody not a lane, man. Motherfuckers will take y'all life over some little shit. Motherfucker, I have a hundred k in cash and be like, I right, die for this and still have a million in the bank, two million in the bank, but I'm gonna kill you or or die for this hunt. That's hundred they got on them. That's fifty yeah. they got on them. Yeah. So, game banging. Right. Um. Sh- shit ain't no way. So if you pushing peace. Why haven't you gone live with the other side? 
I was the first nigga to go live with, with who, the ops. Who, who? Who'd you go live? I went live with uh, what's what's freaky man named Preacher dude, uh, J Hood. I went live on sixteen shot page. He was on live for sixteen. I was the first J-Hood. person to go live. Block? Yeah, I was, and I was on some peace shit. I jumped on J J Hood shit and was like, hey, fuck, I'm not for the year with you and none on this bitch gang. But you know what I'm saying? We was talking though. I'm like, man, you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers need to. Hands down, I'm mean, a hands up, guns down campaign, man. We need to stop the violence, man. Woo woo. So that bitch talking to Shorty. That was like eight months ago. Okay. At least so five. Or not hell, no. At least six, seven months ago. Yeah, you. So you know, you know Jay Hood. Yeah, I know Shorty. Before all of the. Yeah, I know Shorty. I know a lot of them niggas like my age and under, like from twenty. I want to say twenty six to twenty seven on up. To the mid thirties, I know from from the O. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like we know, no, all us know each other personally. My folks was going to schools. My folks was at my auntie parties, my little cousin them parties. I was at they parties. So yeah, I know a lot of them niggas. Like Jay Hood ain't never been one of them niggas that was like, you know, gangster gang. Yeah, he a fighter. You know? That's what he said. I mean, shit. Last time I saw him, he was running. All I saw was feeding ass cheeks. Oh, uh, uh, he was running from you. I took it the last time I saw him like he was running, gang. Um, folks, great, man. I ain't had no bacon on me or nothing. I wasn't trying to take his life. I was just trying to beat him. It was just you? And uh, hell no. It was a lot of us. It was a lot of them. Okay. And he was running? Of course they ran. Yeah. I know y'all ain't missed that part of the story. He always say, yeah, I saw them. PD, I had to get out of there. Everybody got out of there. Where you see him at? That niggas came and rocked my doorbell, shorty, one day. Oh, they was look. Oh, yeah, okay. They was looking for you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> niggas came around my doorbell. My mama would say, "Hey, man, all these little ass kids on the side of my motherfucking house. I, I think they had and trying to jump on you. You was in the house. Nah, hell no. Nah, I was on the block. Oh. Blockhead. Yeah. Blocks. So that's what Jay Bain was talking about. Always outside on the, on the block, bro. Yeah. So, um, why haven't you been on no jumper? Fuck no jumper, cuz. Fuck no jumper, cuz. Stop, look. I was real shit like I was telling my homie J-Main last night, right? Because he was asking, like, man, just gonna go on no jumper. It's some little money. My motherfucker gonna make more money. And, like, this is my job. Like, normally, I don't even play with people like that. Like, but why can't I can play with him now? You play with my homie. You on two great. He don't play with L.A. Capone, mama. He don't play with Vaughn, mama. He don't play with O.D. Perry, mama. He don't play with a lot of the BDs, mama. He don't even play with the BDs, period. You know what I'm saying? He cut certain shit Like when you come for the BDs On his platform He yeah 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 He, he cut shit short He cut, he cut it short he, he don't even wanna hear it But when he mentioned it Like Have he The real question is Have he ever met Wooski right Yeah Never He never even had a, a grown You never even had a grown man Conversation with this man But you always attacking folks You got people coming on your platform Like And you You, you initiate the conversation Mm-hmm. I, what, what, what do you think about Wooski Or What about Wooski this and, cause That's lame gang That's so fucking lame gang Cause Wooski ain't bothering nobody Shorty Like Shorty He really in his own lane Like He ain't dissing no motherfuckers He ain't not trying to slide Or kill a motherfucker Shorty just fell back Like Folks is Recovering He's healing yeah. Some people heal faster than others Like I was shot in my nugget too Like I, I heal quicker though I, I progressed it quicker Oh um, bro you know what I'm saying? I started taking my life serious. Because I ain't want to act like my son. I ain't want to be the same age as my son. Mm-hmm. See what I'm saying? I don't want to be the same age as my daughter. So I started picking my shit up, getting on my shit, right? But I just got all off topic. But yeah, I didn't, though. Because that's how, like, that's how deep that shit rubbed with me when I hear him trolling Wooski. Then he had come for Mama Duck. Like, damn, don't you steal all that lady some money? He owe him money. What the fuck? You playing with this lady all on the internet, but you still owe this lady like seven, eight hundred dollars with your rich ass. And that's crazy. How he owe him money? Man, I ain't gonna get all into they 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 financial details of what they had going on, but they had some shit going on where he ain't hold up his end of, of the market. Yeah. But you can sit here and make fun of this lady and allow people to make fun of her and make fun of her son on your platform is crazy, gang. Mm-hmm. So what I got to say to why I ain't never been on no jumper yet, fuck Adam. Um, bro, until he learns some fucking respect. So I'm talking about like some real respect, bro. And money not going to always buy your way into forgiveness, gang. Oh, Tuka, you got to really, because you got to really apologize, cuss. 
Oh folks are all them Crip Mac niggas And all that shit You got all them motherfuckers Up on your platform That shit not gonna save you gang Cause I was on my way down there On some fuck shit For real for real I had my mind set To be on some fuck shit Me and my homie And we gonna go down there show him like Are you always saying Something about Wooski Got something to say About CC 3rd and all us We gonna show you how Like we the real Animals gang I was gonna go on that bitch And make them lay down But now I was gonna be Back in jail Cause they was definitely Sending us in Oh bro so I just I took the easy route. I took the little deposit money. I don't even run off of deposit money. Don't do none of that shit. Like you guys, DJ, you you guys, motherfucking corporate cartel. A lot of motherfucking bloggers and uh, just people who be in the media who have yeah. <clears throat> even you. Yeah. You know you know what I'm saying. Yeah. I don't play like that. But like, gang, I just that shit took G. Like you gotta do some apologizing. And bitch, you don't have to repay me. I don't took her. Ain't no I owe you on this. You already owed me on this. This is this some shit you owed it. And that shit, I, I put that shit right back into my homies. Like, that shit went back to the block, shorty. I don't, bro. Like, so, now you got to make this shit right, shorty. On first grade. And I want you to start with an apology to my homie, shorty. On Tuka. And, and some conversation for his motherfucking time. Oh, bro. Like, I really, like, in real life, like, you bashing the fuck out my homie in the media, gang. For no reason. What the fuck how Wooski done to him? Yeah. Nothing. Wooski ain't even never disrespected the nigga on live and tell him fuck up. Like he Wooski got on that bitch and said, fuck uh uh man, Wooski was saying fuck a lot of them motherfuckers on his live, like blog blogger type people, right? Mm-hmm. SMTV, a few people. I he I'll fuck you, SMTV. Fuck out my live. I, like, Adam wasn't one. Yeah. So if you had like people like that coming for Wooski. It'd be different, like, oh, yeah, well, if Wooski was Wooski, he was coming for them. But they ain't like that with Adam. Mm-hmm. You, you, your contract was you couldn't even discuss us or do interviews with us while Vaughn was alive. Now you want everybody from the rack or you want a motherfucker from CC3 from all the way up there because Vaughn gone. But at the same time, you still making fun of folks now. Now, I ain't going to get up there and do that interview and then you try to take certain clips and make fun of me because I'm a tweaker. Yeah. Fucker come catch you and rob you and that snow bunny and trunk, you bitches. I'm just playing. I'm I'm just joking. Just joking. I'm a YouTuber, y'all. I'm a kid. Man, maybe his wife would give you some. Man, nah, uh, you know what? <laughs> I, at first I was. I had a little, I, I was on some little faithful shit, shorty. But I got some shit going on in my life right now with a wimp with females. So now you know what I'm saying? I'm just fucking right now. <laughs> Feel me? <laughs> just fucking. What what happened that you what turned you from being faithful? To you got some shit going on. What happened, bitch? My girlfriend got got caught with her ex boyfriend. Oh man, she cheated on you, brother. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? It happened to the best, brother. She broke your. When was this? Not when you went to jail for the week. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, seriously though. Like, yeah. It, 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 it was it when you went to jail? Yeah, seriously. How, how you how, how you catch her, man? Man, he screenshot man. He 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 screen recorded. He heard my phone, but that he shit. He sent it to you. Nah, he did. But then I wasn't replying oh, to the nigga in my man. DM. You feel me? So he he fucking gave it to the bloggers. So and now the bloggers put it out. And like I ain't even mad off the fact that she was on the phone with her ex or got caught on the phone with another nigga shaking ass. Like I took her. I was mad off the fact that my lady ain't look good doing it. Yeah. On first grade, it would have been different if her her sex appeal was. Up here on that bitch I would've been like Okay Okay Shit let me re-rock this bitch I might have to post that bitch myself But then when I was looking at it I was like come on baby What the fuck What what, what, what girl was this? My little lady man um, Bro My little lady I love her though like Cause now I'm like Y'all see like I be having all that I, I don't I don't know what's to that video Cause I be Spending a lot of money on her And shit so No let me stop playing all though no, seriously though, man, I love my little boo. Was she the one that was yeah. at, the, at the crib? Uh-huh. Oh man, damn man. Oh man, she did that to you after you was paying for the hair and the nails. Man, that's little shit. You know she paid. I think when it comes to money and shit like that, that's, that's little shit. You know, because she be spending that shit on me too on first so, grade. So wait a minute, y'all back together? Huh? Y'all together? We together? Y'all like in a relationship? Yeah. What's going on, man? You took her back. She don't punish me right now, Lord. You took her back. You took her back. Butter. You took her back. Keep it real, man. <sighs> All right, come on, man. I'm a sucker, Lord. You know I took her back. I ain't took her shopping too long. Took her, took the. I don't really got the bit. I head told myself in that hole too. Yeah. Yeah, man. But now nah, she don't punish me right now, though. 
So so I've been single ready to mingle. I've been mingling like a motherfucker. I've been mingling like a mango. So you know her ex? You know him? I know of him. Okay. But he knows you. And he- of course. Everybody know me. I'm butter, okay. bro. I ain't going like, to, like, not, I, I am being cocky. Like, I'm butter. What was her, what was her excuse? She ain't had one. She owned up to it? Yeah. Okay. She ain't had one. Like, she thought I just kept it real. Like, yeah, like, she woke me up by my sleep with it though. I was gonna see it anyway. Yeah. But she woke me up by my sleep. Was like, "Hey, look, you should go on the internet and see this video. If you call me, if you want to talk to me about it, you we can call. We can talk. If if not, I understand. You know. Yeah. I don't know. I saw it. I ain't gonna lie, shorty mama. I was, shorty, I was, I was afraid to go kill her stupid ass. Nah. No, damn. Yeah. I take that back. Yeah. But now, though, seriously, like. <laughs> Motherfuckers don't Like in real life People don't understand How hard some, Another person love is For a person Like mm-hmm. Even with the dude With the guy With the, his situation Like He don't know What my mind state was mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying I could've easily Snapped out of Like fuck it I'ma kill this bitch And kill him too right. Cause they playing on my name Cause like Our motherfuckers Went to the bloggers Y'all went to the Y'all went to the media You want that much attention gang? Like You went to the media on Tuga, like, you probably is her best sneaky link ever. Yeah. Never probably hit that pussy again. That's goofy shit. But then that, 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 that fuck up shit, like, for niggas like me, you know what I'm saying? Because I be sneaking and geeking. I'm, I'm somebody's favorite sneaky link, too, yeah. right? You had a whole second guess in the sneaky links doing shit like that. Yeah. No? I ain't mad at them, though. Oh, um, bro, like, I was salty at first, though. I ain't gonna took, I ain't gonna lie. I was, I was salty, man. On um, B, I was like, damn, bitch. Yeah, so um, back to the no jumper thing. When when did they send you the deposit? Man, they ain't send me nothing. Okay, so you said you. you they got you, something, but they ain't get something to me. Okay, so um, you're not you're not doing no jumper. Um, you say they owe Mama Duck and stuff like that. Fuck Mama Duck. Apologize Wooski. to the trenches. Yeah, and you Fuck said something about Wooski. So he um, gotta apologize to shit, Black Gang, and. He got to pay us some more money. So, um, Wooski, I, I seen an interview he did, too, with, um, I think you might have been there. Was it Kim Capone? Capone? Yeah, I ain't like that yeah. interview at all. All right. So, on some real I shit. Seen it, I, I, I didn't really. I couldn't. It was hard for, to watch. Yeah. So, I couldn't finish watching it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, um, so you, you seen the interview and you said you didn't like it. Did you tell Kim that? Yeah. 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 I told him I ain't really like it because... It's like certain shit that Cam, even Cam, I had to explain to Cam, it'd be like certain shit you can't put on the internet or you can't present it a certain type of way to the internet because they run with it a certain type of way. Mm. And I felt like, Cam, you asked the question and you know folks had took a pause on <laughs> answering it because he was really thinking about what you asked him. Yeah. But you just put it out there, how you put it out there, I felt like that shit was weak. Yeah. You feel me? Every, he added everybody else, everybody else get cut, snip. Edited things throughout they shit. He could have. I feel like he could have asked the question and cut that bit right to the part where Wooski's answering. Yeah, not the you know long pause. Yeah, yeah, that was crazy as hell. And folks in that bit sober as hell. Like Wooski like to get high. Yeah, folks like to smoke weed. And then he in the facility in the function where he can't even. He can't even. I can't vape. Yeah, folks got a weed pen in his pocket. He couldn't even smoke the weed pen in that bit. So it's like. You asking all these questions, he can't even come. He can't even loosen up and yeah. get in his comfort level with yeah. you. Motherfuckers in this uptight facility, but business is business. Yeah. But then at some point, you gotta like, in order for certain businesses to work, you you gotta compromise with the persons you doing business with. And that situation wasn't a compromisable situation. Period. Okay, so um, recently, Mama Duck, did you did you say she messed around with King J, King Lil J? Man, have you ever seen me in the media speaking on Mama Duck in, no. in a negative way? No. I when I speak on Mama Duck, I speak very highly of right. or, or I'm going crazy because the motherfucker playing with her name mm-hmm. over her son because of her son, or just playing with her son name. Excuse me. And f- with, with the Mama Duck situation, I just felt like on oh, Tucker, she's like you overgrown and you chasing this shit. On Tuga, at some point we gotta say, 
Right is right, wrong is wrong. You know what I'm saying? And she was wrong in that situation. I went to her crib. I had a conversation with her at her house. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? And this 50 year old woman went to the internet instead of leaving in that where it was mm-hmm. with me and her. She went to social media because of who I am. Had I been anybody else, she might not have been. She wouldn't have went to social media with this situation. Mm-hmm. But I'm butter. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers chasing this shit for real. Like, Folks, mama really a clout chaser, G. On two grade, like we, motherfuckers didn't really like motherfuckers knew who folks' mama was because she was making s- ch- children decisions while he was alive. But my Sheena didn't have never had this much attention, gang, and she really don't know what to do with it. She trying to cope with this attention and get more and gang more because there ain't no way in hell a private conversation that me and her had a night before. Made it to the internet. Oh damn, you and Jay Main and y'all y'all ain't had no content to, to use. That's how I look at it. She really don't have no content. This duck motion. Mm-hmm. See what I'm saying? Really think about it. Oh my brother, like I ain't gonna lie, she hurt my feelings though with that shit, shorty. Did you call and talk to her about it? I did. Talk to her. Blocked her after afterwards. She didn't apologize. I don't, I I wasn't looking for an apology. Yeah. I feel like it went too far. Yeah. You on that bitch, you got Lil Gay calling me gay. How you got Fag Man calling me gay? He's calling you gay now? Yeah, he called me gay on that shit. Y'all, I was over listening to that shit. That man called me gay and some extra shit. Tell me about some, I like boys. Boy, I'm took a grade, gang. Don't call me gay, gang. Like, that's your one. That's his long lane. Yeah. He's in the home. <laughs> That's a lane you cannot place me in with you, brother. Like, I just I felt some type of way that she even sat on the phone and indulged in that conversation. You know what I'm saying? The fag calling me a fag is crazy. You see what I'm saying? Seriously, bro. Like, and then she sat there and indulged in that shit. Oh, because you said I don't fuck a little Jay. No, what I told you was, what I had asked her was, I was really trying to figure out, like, why do she still fuck with Lil J? If Duck, if Duck wasn't fucking with him, mm-hmm. and Duck wasn't fucking with him because he was going around telling motherfuckers he was fucking on Mama Duck, mm-hmm. and folks weren't feeling that shit. You feel me? So I was, I really want to know, like, why are you still fucking with him? And yo, yo, grandkids, daddy, don't see eye to eye with this guy. This guy, he really don't want to see me make no money. He really don't want to see me win, mm-hmm. right? He want to see me dead. But this still the company you keeping. Yeah. So I, I asked, like, what's to it? What y'all really fucking? Or what? What's going on? Mm-hmm. You feel me? Yeah, she felt some type of way about it. She talked about my new balance right here on that night and everything. Tell me his new balance is dirty as hell. Now my brother, shorty. I don't be in all the designer. But I'm took him one thing I can say, gang. I got to go my, I take my stinky ass home and wipe my shoes out, shorty. Yeah. On my brother. So, like, you saying my shoes was bogus is crazy, shorty. Because you can't afford these right here, cuz. Yeah. No, she can't afford these, let alone his jeans. I ain't even going to go to her. my brother. So, it's like, and it's my money. I'm took, I ain't spending my kids' money. I'm spending money that I don't make on my own, on bro. Like, that's the difference between me and Mama Duck. Mm. She like 50, finally getting some attention. You feel me? She knew I was going to get on her ass. She want motherfuckers to go tune in to her. So y'all tune in to Mama Duck. Yeah. Um, since you're single now, right? And you out here just fucking. You got celebrity crush? I do, though. Who? Glorilla. Glorilla. I don't be. Glorilla. But, okay. You don't be. This the first time you saying it? I mean, I be all on her. I be on her posters and everything on Lil' Brown. Oh, you like, be telling her? I be on to her shit. She respond back? Oh, she ain't reply back to me yet. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, so, so, so you be listening to her music and stuff? I be off that little shit on, bro. You know? Okay. I like that, I like that little hood bitch energy on, bro. Okay. So, Glorilla, who else? That's it? I mean, like... Overall, yeah, like who, who who's your other celebrity nah, crush? Man, I ain't if, got I don't, if you and Glorilla don't work out, who's next? It, I know. Look seriously though, if me if me and Glorilla don't work, you know what I'm saying? I'll took like BB Rex or Halsey. 
BB B- B- Rexa. And, yeah. Or, and the, or Halsey. Halsey. Is that the one she was so, with? Um, the rapper? Machine Gun Kelly. Okay. Yeah. Um, bro, BB Rex or Halsey, hands down, like my ultimate Hollywood crush. Though, she like, was with Machine Gun Kelly. No, nah, she used to be. Or she was with. Uh, 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 G G G G Easy G Easy G Easy, yo, bro, yeah, yeah, G Easy. I thought it was Machine Gun Kelly too, though. Yeah. I don't know, maybe I thought it was Jeezy. I don't know about Michelle but, uh, Kelly, but yeah, go ahead. I ain't gonna lie, Karuchi though. On my brother, I'm gonna get Karuchi. I'm gonna get Karuchi face tattooed on me, shorty. Wait, why? Why Karuchi? Who Karuchi? I be. I took. I've been obsessed with that lady since I was like 14, gang. Yeah, we we gonna tattoo on on, on my rib. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. On my sister, I'm going. I'm gonna get Karuchi whole face. Like, this, it's this picture, all right? Mm-hmm. I'm obsessed with on big. I'm gonna go get that exact picture where she's sitting on top of like a ledge. With her swimming suit bikini on, I'ma get that bitch on my rear. You crazy, brother. I'm serious as hell. Watch. Y'all gonna see them like he's stupid. If I don't get her off that, I don't know how I'm gonna get her short. I've been trying to get that girl since so I was like 14. Yeah. <laughs> That's when she was heavy on the model one side, gang. Yeah. So you been in her DM too? Let's start up. Let's start where she ain't never opened my shit. I've been in her shit since 2019. Same message, just been sitting there. What you say to her? What your shot look like, man? What you say? I just, I, I banged through her shit. I, I ain't come off as no groupie, though. I just came through her shot. I was like, how you doing today? I was like, I, I'm in love with you. Oh, Neil. Yeah. Yo, so, all right, before we get out of here, man, um, <laughs> I know I ain't got no game right? yeah. Hey man Sometimes at work Having no game is the game Get straight Straight to it You know what I'm saying I don't, Bro Just tell her I'm in love with you Yeah um You still in love with her All these years All these That's how I know It's gonna, like, it's gonna be faith though Like I ain't had a, I ain't had A certain type of attention on me When I fell in love with her Right But as the years Had progressed I started getting this attention So it's only a matter of time Like I'm gonna be end up In the same room with her too Cause like my little white boy And they was just Admiral Rose's birthday It was uh Two weekends ago When I suppose Went down to LA And did this shit With no jumper I was gonna go slide To Amber Rose's little party With my little white friends But Fuck no jumper cuz Yeah you should've went to LA man Fuck no jumper cuz They was paying for your flight too Fuck no jumper cuz You could've just went to LA And you had to go to no jumper Man you know? I ain't gonna You ain't gonna lie though I don't like hanging around everybody, bro. You feel me? LA is, they get sticky like tricky. Yeah. LA got um lawns on it on the, in in their front yard. They fool you. Yeah. You think it's nice neighborhood. Fuck us. Get your ass spanked yeah. over there. Yeah. Um how do you feel about Charleston White? He he had a lot to say about Chicago. Yeah, he got a lot to say about me too. I saw his little Oh yeah, what did yeah, he say? He was on you? TikTok to my son, man. I, okay, I understand but the little nigga bought a fall the nigga eight, eight times. For grabbing his ass He's like But he threw me for a loop Cause he said he's gonna spin a dude But <laughs> uh, Like I ain't gonna lie gang I got violated gang Like what Me whooping your ass Don't cut the cut You you pawn my cheek <laughs> You feel me So I had to do something That feel like I, I over won Cause yeah. I won the fights But just like He won one out that eight Yeah So now I gotta go to the screen yeah. See, it would have been different I won all eight fights like, oh, He grabbed my ass I beat him eight times But he won one yeah. Which one he he won? Hey, I ain't gonna lie He won like the sixth No, it was the seventh fight Because we fought one more time After yeah. he won yeah. He did you bad on that one? No, no, no He got me though Yeah Oh, um, bro And he won tired I was tired as hell Yeah It's crazy that you said that Because you told the same story last time But he won one fight You know what I'm saying? He won one fight Yeah He got me I think it was the seventh fight so Chuck, was one last fight after that, yeah. and I beat the fuck out of him and try to get that butt. Uh, so, um, <laughs> <laughs> so Charleston White, he mentioned you on on TikTok. You said, yeah, man, yeah. Um, so w- w- when you see him, how do you feel about him? I don't know, man. You know he played with knives and mace and shit like that. So I don't know, man. Yeah, because if motherfucker stabbed me, you giving me rights to shoot you. I'm going, I ain't gonna lie Motherfucker gonna be Damn butter went to jail For killing Charleston White man Some friendly That's some shit They could've got over with No You not gonna fucking Be cutting my flesh open Or you ain't macing me gang yeah. That's the shit my bitch do When my bitch get mad at me Cause yeah. Alright well man it, It's been good Sitting down with you again man You know what I'm saying 
We'll see you in the future. Man, you know what I'm saying? You, Keep up the music and get them pages going too, man. Man, look, it was definitely a pleasure being up here with you, man. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing like being on Get a Report, man. You know what I'm saying? Podcast, this way it's at, this way it happened. You know what I'm saying? Y'all want to know something? Y'all need to figure this shit out. And, and we still got some butter bucks. That's how we flew here. You know what, Ooh, what I'm saying? Oh, Wizzy, y'all about to slow down, slow down. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, you hear me? Unfortunately, I would have gave up the butter bucks tonight, but I saw I I I sold them all on retail market five ninety nine. We got no. some butter bucks, you know what I'm <laughs> saying? My boy still got the butter bucks. That's how you know you was locked in, man. You know what I'm saying? With the butter bug pandemic, we had a butter bug pandemic, and I went and came and paid all of. <laughs> uh, for sure, we out of here. Peace. Peace. I appreciate it, brother. Sure, man. I appreciate you. Man. I'm caught up in this fast life. Every morning, night I pray. Gotta make it out some way Put a smile back on